Hello and welcome to Terminator Dark Fate Defiance. I'm Shadow Coast and welcome to the channel. We are going to outline what happens if you decide to execute Kelso. Okay. Now, I've we played through this twice, and uh, while maybe ethically or morally we want to let him live, I will say that uh, you are better off probably executing Kelso. You not only receive his Bradley tank, uh, you receive a tank crew uh, from Lieutenant Saxon, which I'll uh, demonstrate here. Uh, and you also actually end up with more resources and more replacement soldiers. The only downside to executing Kelso is that you cannot train uh, your units um, in the town because it's not an operational town anymore uh, from that perspective. But you do get... Uh, more resources or supplies excuse me uh, a tank with the reactive armor um, Very well. from that perspective so sick. let's just outline this what happens uh, if there are any integrators in the area they'll leave you alone Saxon here, Lieutenant. you have good news for me I hope I did his orders and carried out the sentence Kelso's dead great work Lieutenant Believe me, this will help wipe out the Haven Black Mark on your record. Help yourself to any heavy vehicles that deserter had. And I've got a tank crew you can use. Thank you, sir. Our mission here is over. We're moving out. Till next time, Lieutenant. Well, you carried out your orders and cleared your record as mount of command. Feel good about yourself, sir? I feel like a founder again, Mason. That's all that matters. So there we have it. Um, we do have a tank crew over here where Lieutenant Saxon is, so you can kind of use them. I actually think I have one that's tank ready that's closer to it. So we're just going to hop in the tank so you can take a look at it. It's going to take way too long to exfil everybody, so you're going to have to trust me. Um, when I ran this, uh, two different scenarios, I kind of had 300 and call it 80,000 supplies. Uh, when I saved Kelso and I had well over excess, I think I want to say 425, 425,000, maybe a little more uh, supplies when I executed them. Um, here, the Bradley tank, you can see it does have the explosive reactive armor, uh, which is fantastic. You do receive this if you save him, um, but you don't receive his tank. Uh, he has the ATGM launcher, which we can see here. And he also has a plasma auto cannon on it. So it is a pretty good tank. Um, I will say, you know, this will allow you to have at this point, I want to say three or four tanks. I currently already have two. So it is a nice addition. Uh, you do get that extra tank crew, which is nice and more supplies. The major disadvantage is this is no longer a functioning town. Uh, so you can't really upgrade or interact with it. Uh, but depending on where you're heading, that might actually not matter that much, especially if you're heading to the integrator camp after this. Um, so that is what happens if you execute Kelso. If you are trying to kind of optimize tanks and supplies, you should execute them. Uh, for my main playthrough, I opted not to, but that was more on moral ethical grounds. Let me know what you did in the comments, and hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please drop a thumbs up and hope to see you in future videos. Shadow Ghost out.